<laughs> hey fam, happy new year. So I got here some cards and we're gonna get intuitive. I hope you guys are doing well. All right, I am down to a couple more days here in Miami and I'll be going back to my place in the middle of nowhere, Florida. <laughs> but um, it has been a journey and I'll do more of an update on my Empress Talks. Let's get intuitive, let's get into this reading. I got some really amazing cards here. First off, we're starting off with the world. The world, guys, the world. Completion of cycles, lessons, animals running amok in here. <laughs> I have, I don't know the, if he'll pop up, but my friend has a cat that's like, obsessed with like when I pull out the cards and stuff like that it's pretty funny I don't know cats are cats right anyway so we have the world here okay and the world is a completion we have just completed a year we're starting a new one this is a new part of the journey and I see here a really amazing energy with counterpart energy I I literally pulled out um eh, sorry <laughs> I pulled out both the king and queen of wands, okay? In between them was the hermit. So these two energies have been undergoing some lessons of their own. They have kept to themselves to try to learn what what lessons they have to do in silent contemplation, whatever it may be, so that they can come together or separately or however, but these two energies are coming together to make some really amazing work, creative work, fiery and passionate. My hair is in my way. <laughs> um, and it is beautiful. Ooh, and I dropped it. Uh, um, see, with the, the leoncito here. <laughs> um, King of Wands is in a leadership position, knowing what they want, knowing how to implement it, whereas the Queen of Wands is the I want it's the divine feminine energy but there is more of this passive like I will support this king energy but the queen is already in their power as well the queen is just as creative just as motivated and in fact I feel like with this card it's like yeah I got you babe this here this fire I got you I'm gonna light it up like it's just that I see so much fire and and it's playful and it's awesome and it's i see so much bravery and courage in the months to come with these energies this <laughs> uh divine counterpart energy whether it is the parts within yourself the male and the divine feminine and divine masculine energies within self or with another i see this coming into fruition um after so long we got here the seven of pentacles and there is the cat the cat Hello, are you gonna jump onto the bed? Nope. Oh my god. <laughs> that is that is cat behavior. Okay, so anyway, back to the reading. I have tried so hard to stay focused. This cat is just like zoom, zoom, everywhere. Eating my <laughs> eating the flowers that my friend and I got from my mom. Um, because like her uh, anniversary of when she passed away, that was like December 29th not that anyone asked I just felt like sharing <laughs> um the cat's been eating the flowers <laughs> um either way this is um here hold on guys I got you we have here the two of cups and the ace of pentacles this foundation that is being set all right is a beautiful one and there's this union within self within an, with another it's just like oh my god this cat <laughs> there is so much something about hands i i feel that it's like i know i said this in another reading recently but i feel that you guys are gonna be holding each other's hands holding each other to the next phase of this journey and it makes sense <laughs> queen of wands holding out like there's like this spark this fire it's like i got you here let me and then i don't know this is pretty damn cool i like it it's a very beautiful energy to start off like the year with the readings and stuff i am still recovering from a cold so i didn't record earlier on i had lost my voice and everything so i'm doing better much better um 
we have the four of wands here we have a lot of fire guys this is beautiful celebration and celebrating i don't know it's, i see a lot of dancing music and just enjoying yourselves i i see that with both the the um, the queen and king of wands and a lot of oh there it goes okay i am so hyper aware of every little noise here guys i'm so sorry um, then we have here the three of cups, another, the three energy is creativity, more creativity and sharing with other like-minded individuals too. So this year is just going to bring so many energies together to bring us together, uh, for this higher purpose, this higher, excuse me, <laughs> this higher, uh, power plan. I don't know. I just, I feel it's. I feel that despite that a lot of things are happening and a lot of the purging is still continuing in the sense of purging of emotions, purging of all sorts of things, we are truly recalibrating to the best version that we want to be within ourselves. And I think that's beautiful and that's why the first card I got was the world. I really truly believe that we are completing cycles, my fam, and it's going to be amazing let me see what else we got here. Balancing energy with the Eight of Pentacles, working hard on endeavors. So here we have planting the seeds and waiting for them to, to give fruit. And then here, wait, where is it? I lost it. Well, the Eight of Pentacles is working on your craft, mastery. And then Nine of Pentacles is like, I got it. I got this. I got this, guys. I got this. So... I don't know. I, I sense a lot of beautiful energy. All right. I was going to make it longer, but I am getting stuff ready here. So I hope that you guys are doing well. I want to send you so much love and feel good vibes and on to the next one. Take care. Bye.